Hello, everyone. Slip my coffee. I just got home. It's Friday afternoon at 3.30. I'm done school for the week. Mm. Well, my last class was a really good class. My last class was good. Oh, this week. Ups and downs, ups and downs, ups and, and yeah, it's like, like a roller coaster. There's no predicting. Mm. Oh, I need my coffee. Today's been kind of a rush. Rush here, rush there. But that's okay. That happens. That happens sometimes. Oh, so how'd the week start off? Week started off quite well. Classes went okay. Um, well, of course, it was Thanksgiving on Monday, so it was a short week. That makes all the difference. You don't hit the ground running after a long weekend. You, uh, you're slow all week. Things don't quite, you make mistakes as to what day of the week it is and things like that. But it's nice because it's short. So that's good. So Tuesday went all right. Wednesday I had, well, my classes at Dune both had presentations this week. And um, the one class positively excelled. And at the, at the end of that class, I said, so how do you feel about this presentation thing? Is it getting better or is it getting worse? Or is it, you know, same. And they said, whoa, we're getting better at it. It feels good. We still feel stressed. It's still hard, but we can handle it and we're getting better at it. The other class, it was like, they, they, that's how it went. They dragged and they went downhill. So I said, so how was this? How were your presentations today? Do you feel better or do you feel worse? And they went worse. And I totally agreed. So I'm going to have to do something with that class. I'm going to have to find out what's dragging them down because this can't, this can't go on. They're going to fail, fail, fail in their presentation part anyway. Unbelievable. Because I handed back the presentation results for the up, up, up class today. And they went, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the other class should, you know, be positive and go for it. And they're just not like that. And I don't know if it's personality or I think it's personality. I think it's the personalities. I don't think they can do anything about it. Sorry, sorry guys, but I think it's the general personalities of the students that are dragging down the class. And it's really sad. They have midterms next week. Eek. same people. Mm. Yeah, I know who's going to do well and who's not. Because I know how the review class is going to go for 
the class I had today, which was the review. Okay, the the class who ha that I had today got the review class. The class that I'm going to do first next week is going to have the review class, and it's going to go completely differently. I predict this. I'm going to try and change it. I will. With today's experience, I can change it. I can make their review experience a great one. That's my goal. I will do it. <laughs> There's one student in that class who I've seen twice. Count it twice. And he's come to none of the quizzes and none of the presentations, has written none of the work, has presented never, not at all, nada. Yeah. And they want me to make sure to give it my all that he passes. Not giving him breaks, but giving him all the opportunities I can to achieve success. Okay, that's fine, I'll do that. They're going to, one of the supervisors is going to give him his two quizzes on Friday. It's fine, as long as I don't have to do it. I don't want to lose time because he doesn't have the time to come to class. Okay, never mind. So that's that. And um, let's see. Yeah, so one class is going really well, the other class is not. My morning class is just doing wonderfully. And the one literacy student who was sort of having a hard time getting into the swing of things. I'm mobilizing the other students, they're helping her because she's literacy and they're level one. So they can, you know, they're talking, they're reading, they're, and she can't read. She can talk, but she never learned how to read. She never learned how to write a whole lot. So she was dragging and now the class is helping her and that's really helping her spirits. So that's nice. That's going well. My night classes are progressing at very different rates. The multi-level class is going along well. They are all gelling and they're responding to what I'm teaching so that's nice. The other class, which is another literacy level one class, nobody showed up this week. Now, usually on Tuesdays, I don't have anyone show up because of skills-based teaching, where if students are a different level in listening and speaking or reading and writing, then they go to that level on the other day from your. So I have two students. I will have two students. I only have one right now. I have one student who is level three, four at listening and speaking, but level one reading and writing, reading and writing, which is my class, reading and writing. So he's in my class on reading and writing days, listening and speaking days, he goes next door to Tina's class. So on Tuesdays, I have no student, and I'm getting a new student next week, but she is similar levels as my other student, so she's not going to be there on Tuesdays either. No students. It's just okay, I can do my emergency lesson plan, my you know, lesson plan for when I'm sick. I've been working on that. It's taking a while, I know, it's not really much fun. <laughs> Working on a lesson that you hope never gets given. Anyway, I should wrap up and go shopping with my husband. Ooh, I love going shopping. 
Happy weekend, guys. See ya.